Yo, what's happening, guys? It's Dakota Golden Bird Fox here. Guys, it's been a minute. It's been an absolute minute since I've made a video. So much has been happening in my life. I moved. Don't mind the background. This room's temporary right now. But regardless, I moved. And I'm in a way better place now. So, yeah, I'm going to be grinding on the videos now. And I'm going to be actually moving into my solid rooms pretty soon within the next week so that's pretty exciting anyway let's jump right into the video all right so this video is going to conclude by the ways to look more confident in public so the first way to look more confident in public is to you want to have you want to have like this aura of confidence coming off of you like a projection and people can feel that around you you just have this confident structure about you when you're walking when you're out in public eyes will be drawn towards you you need to extract their energy so another thing the second thing is do you have straight posture when you are walking so you want to have your shoulders back not like too back like you're like but of course but not too much but you want to have your shoulders back nice and so you have a nice structured straight frame that also adds to the confidence in your approach and your walk so you want to make sure that you do that the third step the third step is really really crucial whenever you are walking in public whenever you are meeting someone whenever you are going for coffee whenever you're going for food and you have that interaction with somebody an employee somebody out in public a stranger you always want to make sure that you look into their eyes you want to look into their eyes because that shows a sign of confidence and you're confident in yourself to look into their eyes because your eyes tell a lot about you. You can smile with your eyes. You can look angry with your eyes. You know, there's so many facial expressions that your eyes are capable of. So you need to make sure that you look right in their eyes when you are having a conversation with them. It is also respectful. And I would say the fourth thing that you should really do to have confidence when you're out in public is you need to not give what people think of you you really you really don't because if you're always thinking oh that person's going to judge me of how i look that person is looking at me because of how i look you know and you always have like this self-criticism when certain people are looking at you because you we look at yourself in that way if that's going through your mind what you think is going through their mind so you need to adjust that with yourself you need to have complete responsibility and confidence for when you do that because you don't know what people are thinking when they're looking at you if they're just you screw them honestly who cares who cares like i'm an amputee as you all know I get looks and everything like I used to wait before, but you know, I I carry myself with confidence. I really do. People are attracted. I project a certain more off of me. So when people look at me, I take that as they find me attractive. They look at me like I'm confident. See, I switch the logical framework of that. What I think of someone's thinking of me. So I think positively, like, oh, they think I'm awesome, they think I look good, I think I dress well. And, you know, the number five thing is obvious, right? So you need to choose a really good fashion sense for your body, you know, like even a haircut that suits your face. I haven't actually personally 100% figured that out yet because I, I don't really go to the barber often. I do I'm gonna I'm gonna get like some type of fade but you need to look smacks 
So what I do it goes for actually taking care of your skin to look more presentable, to dress accordingly to certain events. That's very important too. You need to dress accordingly to certain events. You're not going to be taken seriously in certain events, you know, like certain places, certain workplaces. You can't just show up to business meeting in sweatpants and a clip shirt and a hoodie, right? Like you're not gonna be taken serious. Like people are like to dress how you want. Like yes, I agree with that, but at the same time there's a place and a time for certain things. If you're in a business meeting, you wanna wear a nice suit, you wanna look formal or semi formal, right? You can wear a blazer with a simple tee, even a tank top if you want, right? So you can even mix and match all sorts of clothes variations, right? So there's all sorts of ways to go about clothing and fashion and what mixes and what doesn't. So, but the most important thing about that is you find what you feel looks best on you and what you feel confident in because that's what this whole video is based around is carrying yourself with confidence in public. I used to have very low confidence, I have my doubts, I have body dysmorphia, you know, like, it's an amputee, right? But I'm very confident in myself, so, guys, take those five tips and implement them into your life. You really need to, it will, it's not even for the other people, it is for yourself, and you will attract what belongs to you you will attract that attention just solely by feeling good and confident in yourself by what the work you put into yourself and your appearance. So take those five tips, implement them in your life. Remember, subscribe, hit the notification bell for when my videos are uploaded. Guys, I am back. I am for real, for surely back now. So I'm going to be making daily videos. So guys, I'm back, baby. Subscribe. Catch you in the next video. Love you, DG team. Peace.